What's up guys, we are taking you behind the scenes on our last episode ever. The Henry Danger finale starts right now. Game what? <laughs> These final episodes are about the fate of danger. They're about wrapping it all up. It's about um, wrapping her all up, if you will. Yep, yep. It's a lot of uh, it's, it's a lot going on. There's a lot of story there. Look at this room, everybody. Check out the pics. Check out the stuff. Thank you, guys. People who need to have their ending. There's a lot of closure. There's some closure, there's some new beginnings. Mm. Um, every end is a new beginning. Not to sound like a bumper sticker, but, but, but that's true. Yeah. Also, how's my driving? Um, um, what was the question again? <laughs> yeah, what were we? It's been five seasons. It's been 128 episodes. That is 2,816 minutes. That's almost 47 hours of pure Henry Danger Entertainment. We're right? pitching this weekend! Yeah. That's all I do when I go home. What makes Henry Danger a bit different than some of the other shows out there, I guess, would be in real life, we have kind of the same friendship as on screen. So it's very easy to bring those adventures and those dynamics to life in the show. And I think that we just tackle a lot of different issues and I hope that a lot of people feel seen when they're watching the show. Let's do this! <laughs> All right, here we go. Page one, scene A, we're at the man cave. Kid Danger, Charlotte and Piper are still in the middle of the man cave waiting for Jasper to come back. Okay, the most important thing we have to do is stop dress. Can't be done next. <laughs> uh, actually, it can be done. Nah, just fought him, lost, bad, so next. <laughs> The writers did a really great job of uh, coming up with a story. And they and they actually incorporated a lot of stuff that you and I wanted to see. Totally. And Jason and I met with the producers and the writers. We pitched, you know, a lot of very specific ideas that we wanted to see in the ending. So a lot of what you're, you'll see, stuff that came from the original pitch that we had. The, these these two right here. Stop looking at me! Kiss, 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 this kiss, This stuff and I kiss, are just friends! Kiss. <laughs> 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 Start punching the stuff again. Back in the man cave, give Ginger puts his phone away. <sighs> It's his favorite spot in Swellview. Oh, that's why he wants to put a statue up there. Yes. We don't want to ruin anything. We don't want to give anything away. Right, but, but in this back then, I think it's the um, best stuff we've ever made ever. And we fade out. End of series. We just <laughs> did, did our the final table read for the two finale episodes. Yes. It um I went think well. It went, yeah, it was yeah. fun. <laughs> it's just pretty crazy, like savoring, looking around, and like. Savoring, yeah, saving the, last the last moments. moments. Like it's kind of crazy because we've been doing this like forever, so it's like definitely an adjustment. But um, it, was it was really cool. fun, and there was like a really good energy in there. So, so that was the last table read. We'll see you on set. Well, what happens in the Henry Danger finale? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, we're all trying to fight off these cave people because Drex brought them back from like 101 million years ago. And also Captain Man gets sent back from 101 million years. See, I'm just starting to remember the first part, so I'm gonna mix it up on you guys. I'm gonna mix it up. It's all coming together. Yeah, it's, it's all coming together. In the world of Terrence. Yeah. Four cameras, Mark. Action! Let me go! There's a lot of action in it. Um, it's uh, some of the most ambitious stunt stuff we've done. We're going out with a bang. Um, we know the show means a lot to a lot of people. Six years in the life of anybody is a long time. So we want to do it justice and we want to do right by you guys. You guys set? Set. Here we go. In three, two, one, go! go! <laughs> Doing Harry Danger, I've learned to do some some stunts, and they're they're fun. I, I don't think I was super confident about stunts at first. I definitely wanted to do them, but uh, all in all, it's it's pretty safe, and we, we have fun doing it. And they they look cool, and they're fun to do. Two, one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was lucky. <laughs> Why do you hate me? Like again, we grew up kind of as a family, and we, you know, we love each other like a family. And it's been a fun experience, honestly. Not being in school, not being around friends, this does become like your home away from home. All right, to everybody, we'll wrap another one of our wow. standing sets. This time it is the Hart House. So, like any good set, it's a little messy right now, <laughs> but join me in saying goodbye to it. Oh. I 
I took a couple of things. You took some things? I, I might have taken something. I didn't know you took things. I didn't get anything. I took I'm, something. I made Sean took something yesterday. I'm what? There's costume props that I'd like to take, like the Elton John outfit, but couldn't fit it in my car. Yeah. You're just stealing things off the set. Like, you as took, soon as they wrap the sets, everybody goes in like bandits. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's like, just <laughs> takes what they can. We raided, we raided junk and stuff, actually. Yeah, and we yeah. Took some. There are definitely a lot of things that I would love to take home. We actually, they just tore down junk and stuff. So, Ella and I just like kind of raided it and got a few different things. I have like a sword, I got like a little robot thing, a little blaster. I haven't taken anything yet, but uh, I'm planning on keeping the mask and. You uh, get new masks every week? Yeah. I've been using the same crusty. Old really? Room. Yeah, there's an old band-aid inside this one. <laughs> and I've always wanted to take some of the clothes because I feel like my style is very similar to Charlotte's in certain ways. I'm definitely still have yet to raid the wardrobe, but I will be doing that. And I'm gonna take the gum tubes. I'm gonna have those just as memories so I can show my kids. I mean, like, oh, oh my god, like, am I gonna show my kids the show? Like, that's awesome. Well, you like, should, yeah. <laughs> We're shooting a scene where we're running away from a bunch of cavemen, and I, well not actually me, but my stuntman gets to crash through the glass door of junk and stuff, and he's gonna completely shatter it. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> they are putting small explosives, very small explosives in the glass, so that when it goes off, it'll crack the glass partially, so when the stuntman goes to run through it, it won't be a solid piece of glass. It makes it safer for him to do the stunt. Because again, if you're going through a solid piece of glass, it's gonna hurt. So cracking the glass makes it so it's just, it just pretty much crumbles. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> After we crash through the store, this is our last scene in Junk and Stuff ever. And that'll be it. And it'll be a little sad, a nostalgic aspect of Junk and Stuff, but uh, all good things come to an end. is a series wrap on junk and stuff. We are done. No more junk, no more stuff. Goodbye, lovely store. I'm so mad at you, Henry. Me, Jace, Dana, go to... Hey. Uh, we go to this petrified piece of stump and we bash it and laser it. Heck yeah. Oh my god. I'm not walking up this mountain anymore. My path ends here. Well, uh, your path ended right at Captain Man's punching stump, so. Good timing. <laughs> it's been really awesome getting to know the cast more and more. Just from the first moments, we've kind of always gotten along, which is crazy, because you hear about like certain dramas on other sets and stuff, but we've always been a big family. Like from the beginning, we've always hung out and you know, we still always hang out and just do all these different things together. And yeah, we just know each other super well now. So it's just like a big family. Uh, Did you hear that? Yeah, that's me laughing. Wait till I tell him to kiss it. <laughs> I tell him to kiss no. it. No. <laughs> He said he wanted to crawl inside that stump and live there for a hundred and one million years. Yeah, so? So, maybe he's inside his punching stump. It has been fun. It's and I think trying to make time. make the crew laugh and make ourselves laugh, you know, we want to we want to enjoy yeah. the show. We want to make something that we want to watch. Yeah, exactly. You know, like it's a family show, and sometimes funny is just funny. And I, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't want to sit down with my kid and watch something that didn't entertain me. It was a real privilege, like watching you guys grow up and being there for that, and, and being tasked with. I'm honestly just, just the honor of being able to be like the set adult. You should come on more missions with us. Can I? No. No. You're destroying my kicking stump! Choppa? Hello? You can't own a stump. They just for everyone. They're gonna love it's it. It's a great They're ending. They're gonna love it. They're not leaving on so much of a cliffhanger. It wraps up the show nicely with everyone kind of going in their own paths. Yeah, yeah, do your part. Let's just keep lasering him out of this amber, all right? This is taking too long. What? Hey, more time! We kept... No, 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 no
I feel good about the way I, I wrap up my story and it's uh, it's bittersweet, but it's kind of nice. I mean, it's kind of feels, there's a there's a certain amount of we did it, like accomplishment. I'm, like, a lot of people are sad and there is, there is a sadness to it, but it also, it's like, wow, we really, did this and we really lit this up and like it really you feel good about I it i feel good about it. it's like would you, wow would you say it feels good hey where are you where are you going i'm leaving <laughs>